Hi guys, it's me Joy. Uh, you're probably wondering why I speak English right now instead of Bulgarian. That's because I'm going to show you a pageant look, which is not... Um, how can I say it politely? In Bulgaria we don't have a pageant culture, you know, we don't care about pageants like in Asia or Latin America it's not a thing okay so if I speak um, Bulgarian if I if I'm speaking in Bulgarian in this video I need to call it just disco look <laughs> so I'm going to show you something that um, I used to do back in 2015 when I competed in Miss Universe as you may know some of you may know uh, and please don't judge me too hard English is not my mother language so it's not perfect but i'm trying and i think you will understand especially when i show you the products and how i use them on me so i'm going to do my hair of course and my makeup so yeah welcome to my youtube channel First I will blow dry my hair and we need a volume, okay? For the hair in every pageant you need a volume and curls. <laughs> so I will use this um, hair dryer. I think you know this hair dryer, it's Philip, but it's the newest one, IQ technology, which is very interesting by the way. Here there is a sensor that um, measures the hair temperature a few thousand times in a second. So I want to show you something, you can make even a massage, scalp massage with this one. Um, I will put my hand here and you will see that it's not hot. It makes your hair dry but it's not hot that it can damage the hair. So this is why I love this hair dryer. See. Now, to curl my hair, I will use this one. We section the hair. When I'm doing my curls, I don't like them to be little curls. I... Am I focused? When I do the curls, I make big sections of hair, so that way it looks more natural. I make the smaller one into three, okay? A lot of hair. One, it's this. And the other here, I make like this, so I put it in my mouth. And now we wait. Uh, this is the curl that I made. And, you know, I don't bother the curl, I don't uh, push it, I don't do anything with it. I just leave it to cool down and then you will see what I do. You see now, this is the curl that I need. And then the third section. This is the bigger section because my hair is not in the middle but it's here so for this section we have more hair and I am cutting it into five sections. Now I will see. We did it for five minutes. We have these big sections of hair. I made five on this here on this side and uh, three here. I think that yeah, three and five. So eight sections. All my hair. Now it's hot. We clip it like this on the back so that we make room for our makeup which is the fun part so if you ask me what's the most important thing about this kind of makeup i will always say it's the foundation the foundation the skin needs to be flawless so i'm using strong uh, products you know don't think that I do this in my normal life in my everyday life no never I do this only when I go to disco 
<laughs> in Bulgaria and I did this in 2015 and when I remember about this time I'm like my heart is wants to pop out so first of all I already put my skincare um, maybe I need to do some video about skincare in English I always put two primers because one of them is Shine Killer. Um, I have, it's not oily, but it's um, it's oily on my T-zone or T-zone? T-zone, T-zone. And remember guys, always clean your brush. Always and every time after you put foundation on it. Every um, watery product that you use, if you use shadows, you may clean your brushes on after two or three times of use, but this one every time because bacteria is staying here, you know? So I put the shine killer here, 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 and here, and on my nose. I don't put it in the, um, this part of my face because I don't need it there, it's not shining there, it's dry it's dry here and oily here next primer is fenty beauty i love this primer because it's also a mattifying primer and i put it all over my face i always use a tone that is um more tanned than than me you see here is white here is a little bit yellow to orange because I try to look not like a ghost when I'm on pageants I tried now I don't go to pageants hmm. we put concealer here this is a white concealer um, it's Maybelline it's cheap but it's really nice this one if you can see and I put it like this always these areas you see i use a lot of makeup and a lot of product this is what we do in pageants it's not nice for the skin and then we use um, another concealer this is benefit i use this one because i like to put a creamy um, shadows um, right now i look like a clown i know but this is the way that i used to do my makeup back then I'm not doing it now like that never now I use just this BB cream it's really nice I'm showing it to you because it's really nice Misha BB cream and I'm good to go so now we blend everything in and then it's time for powder I'm using gauche and another brush Ferrer <laughs> Ah, Yves Rocher Yves Rocher, Yves Rocher Whatever, just, just powder We need to set everything really nicely I am using this Essence, it's a drugstore Most of my makeup is drugstore I, I don't use makeup in my everyday life well, So I don't need expensive products I put my money in skincare We need some chicks. I use this one, Sleek. Again, it's drugstore brand. I don't even know where I bought this. I put it like here, like this. I smile and I put a little bit of color. I don't put it only in a circle, but I drag it up like this. So my face look a little bit <laughs> and now comes my one of my favorite parts it's golden rose and it's highlight see it I drag it up again I put under my eyebrow so that it stays natural if I make this look um, normally for a pageant I'm doing it in seven minutes maybe eight 
a little bit here, a little bit here, a lot here, a lot here. Even here I put a little bit of a highlight. More highlight, but on the eye I use Shiseido. This is one of my favorite shadows, as you can see, I killed it. I take a brush and I put it right in the corner of my eye, right here in the beginning. And drag it up. And a little bit here. I told you that my look will be heavy for a pageant. But when I say heavy, I don't mean heavy on the eyes. I don't like to put a lot of makeup on my eyes because I think that for me personally it's better when I keep it clean. I just want to create um, something that makes me more beautiful and not create another me, like, like a painting on my face. Just cover the skin, the texture because of the camera and then it's you. I don't like when every girl looks the same on the stage. This is the way I put it. So now I use a black pencil and I put the black pencil here only in the corner of my eye. Only here, like this. Also here, this. Right. And then with fluffy brush, I am just making it like an eyeliner but um fluffy okay so this is the result it's really fluffy uh not heavy but you have a um, definition and then uh it's time for mascara now i'm using this mascara it's size up by sephora i always use the curler i have a nice lashes but on the stage you always put fake lashes um, when a makeup artist is doing your makeup, they always put fake lashes. When I am doing my makeup, I never put them. First of all, I can't. <laughs> I'm always doing it not right. And second of all, I don't like it because it looks and it feels heavy. Alright, what's left? The lipstick. Okay, last but not least, we need to see what happened with the hair. I am using this spray, it's for volume. It's Nivea. I work with Nivea so many years now. I put my hair down like this and I spray it. I'm making the curls bigger by just doing this. And now the final look. Ta-da! <laughs> That's my final look, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope you liked it, I hope I helped you in some way, even maybe just for you smiling. Um, I hope my first video in English was good enough for you. <laughs> I'm sorry for my accent and for my mistakes. As I said, English is not my mother language, but I'm trying, because I know I have a lot of fans that speak English, not Bulgarian. And guys, if you want to see something else, for me in English just write it down in the comment section below. Roy, I hope you are proud of me. See you guys, see you next time.